Yeah I'm tongue-tied, twisted around your finger like a piece of string I'm winded, chasing after your ghost is real exhausting I'm in love, but I don't think it's what I thought it was supposed to be Love story, no guts and no glory How did I get so dizzy? Thinking of you, I don't usually get like this. It's something about you I miss. Could it be we never had that kiss? Well, I don't usually get like this. Get like, get like this. You guys, it's raining today, and I'm just looking out the window at the rain. Lately, my thoughts got me distant. Darker days filling up darker minds. Stuck in this room that keeps spinning Wondering how you been, where you hide Late night drinking, wishful thinking What if you were here? Morning waking, heart still aching Something about Hey guys, it's your girl Jalinda and I'm back again today with another video. Today, you guys, I've just been kind of around the house pulling out Easter stuff, getting ready to decorate for Easter. And I've actually put up everything that I have already for Easter and um, that helps me to know what else I need uh, or if I need more decorations for Easter. And like I told you, uh, the bigger holidays, I have tons and tons of decor, but um, some of the holidays, Easter's a big holiday too, but I have always, when the kids, the kids and the family were smaller, I would have, uh, we would have dinners and we would have party stuff, you know, for the dinners. We would have tablecloths, um, napkins, cups, plates, but I never really bought a lot of odds and ends like for setting around the house, like um, whatnots and doodads, like I call them. Um, I didn't. I never bought a lot of that. It would always be stuff I could put on the wall for decoration for the kids for like Easter egg hunts or whatever. So I have tons of that, but I don't have a whole lot of Easter whatnots, you know, to sit around uh, the house. So um, that's what I'm doing today, guys. So join me. Um, I know that I'm gonna have to get a few more items for Easter um, to put you guys, uh, their windows open, open over here. <laughs> And I'm looking at it every time a car passes, it catches my eye. So um, that's what I'm glancing at. But yeah, I know I'm gonna need more. Uh, I just don't know what. Um, you guys know that I got a couple of Ray Dunn pieces last year for Easter, and I kind of want more of that. So I need to go shopping around for some of that. And yeah, that's what I'm doing today, guys. So join me. So guys, I'm gonna show you the kitchen, um, what I've done in the kitchen so far. Um, not a whole lot, just like I said, little pops of things. Now, I always say that I, because my house is kind of like, it's mostly brown and gold. Um, so I just put, I pick one color that I make my pop with. And this year, uh, because I have it already, it's gonna be like a lime green. And then I'm gonna add some of the other pastel colors, some of the other Easter colors, plus I'm gonna incorporate gold into it. So it just kinda, everything just kinda comes together. Um, that's my goal. We're gonna see <laughs> how it turns out. But that's my goal is to kinda, because I don't like to completely transform my home for one holiday that's gonna last probably, I'm gonna have it decorated probably a month. 
at the most. So I don't want to transform my whole house. Um, it just makes it harder to uh, decorate for me and it makes it harder for me to put things away. So I want it to be as easy as possible and look as good as it can look um, the way that I do it. So let me just go around the kitchen and just kind of show you what I've done in the kitchen. I haven't done a whole lot uh, all around the house, but I will make more videos and show you things as I do them. So here is the kitchen. I'm going to start over by the refrigerator. This is a, a little something I put on top of the refrigerator. I think it looks cute. Um, it's just the platter that I've had, an uh, Easter platter that I had, and then I picked up this little Easter, Happy Easter sign with the bunny at Dollar General, and it was $5. So, and then these vases, you know, I've had you guys have seen those last year and the year before. I just I just incorporate things that I have already and then add to if I if I need to or as I need to. Now in here I like to put pops of color, you know, lime green is my Easter color, so I added some lime green. I had a lemon uh, squeezer in there, so I put that in there. It's yellow, um, springy color, you know, kind of goes along with Easter. So I just put those, added those in there. Um, these are my towels. I took them off because um, we were cooking yesterday and I, I don't use these for cooking. I just use them for decorations. So um, everybody knows not to use them. <laughs> They're just decorations. So we have other ones that we do use. Um, and these just go on the on the handle of the, the, the oven. I think it looks really cute. Um, yeah, I everybody knows don't use my kitchen towels for for actual cooking <laughs> don't get them dirty in other words so these are a couple of platters that I had like I told you we'd always do um, like parties and stuff and so I would have these to put food and stuff on so uh, I still have them and I just keep stuff like that you know because um, I know I'll use it again here is my Ray Dunn spatula that I got picked up last year um, so I, again, I added some of the lime green in with my utensils. I know I have a lot of utensils and I really need to go through those, but everything that I have is usable. It's all good stuff and I just have a lot of it. And I need to really, though, get some of this out of here and um, clear it out a little bit. There's my little bucket from Grove Collaborative. Um, I got some, some cleaning products came in this and it's just so cute. I use it in my kitchen all the time. So I also have um, my pot holders and oven mitt. I've got quite a few. These are the tea towels and stuff that we use for the kitchen mitts. These are my pink or, uh, rubber gloves that I've got in there. But these are tea towels and stuff that we use, that we actually use and wash uh, after we use them. So uh, they, I don't care if they get, <laughs> you know, I don't mind them getting a little, cause you know, when you wash stuff, it's very pretty when you buy it and then when you wash it, Kind of ruins it you know so those over there they just get put out for decoration and i guess if they got dirty or something i would just throw them out and buy new ones um this is oh, part in the water this here is my easter cuppy i have an easter cuppy and i think it's so cute it has the gold ears and it has um a purple straw it has a stopper it won't fall out um and it says hip-hop hooray it's so cute and they also have a purple one that, that has more purple on it but still has the gold ears but it's more purple and it says um extravagant and it's so cute i want that one too i'm gonna pick it up the next time i go to walmart this is where i got it i got it from walmart so here's some more of those platters with the eggs i think they're beautiful i think they just look so cute for easter and the other um platter is just a green one just one that I thought matched so here's my let me just tell you something before I show you this let me just tell you I am not done with this <laughs> by a long shot I have ideas for my tear track I have wanted this for so long and I always said that once I got one that I would decorate it to the nines and it would just be gorgeous so this is the beginnings of my Easter two tier tear tray I have this, I know I'm gonna use this. It, has, it says Easter. Easter, the only time it's okay to put all of your eggs in one basket. I think that is adorable. So that's definitely going on there. I'm gonna figure out a way to put 
you know, the colorful eggs on. I have a um, three wick candle that smells really good that it says let the sunshine in. And I've had that for maybe a, a year or so. I think I used it last year in the summertime. But I'm gonna definitely do some more things with my tear tray. I'm, this is not two tier tray standard for me. I'm gonna do more, <laughs> I promise. Okay, so this is like a one of those vases that I've had for years that I just keep bringing out. And I had these little garden um, reflect, I don't know what to call them. Um, they, they spin, if you hang them, they'll spin. And they're really pretty and they reflect the sun. So I just put those in there just because they matched. And I used to use them, like I said, for parties and stuff when I had parties yeah, for the younger kids. Those kids, the kids that I talk about that I used to have this stuff for are now adults. They are like, they are 25 and, and older. So <laughs> if that tells you anything about uh, who they are now and how long I've had this stuff, uh, that tells you a lot about how long I've had this stuff. Um, but these guys are now grown up, and one of these days when we're together, I'm gonna have to do a video with them so that you can see the kids that I'm talking about now. I don't have kids of my own. Uh, for those who don't know, kids, um, those of you who are new, who don't know, I don't have kids of my own. Um, my boyfriend has a, his youngest son is, is 12 years old, and that's who you see on the videos with me sometimes uh Ty Ty he's he's 12 years old and that's uh, my boyfriend's son I don't have kids of my own we don't have kids together so um yeah and when I was when those kids that I talk about my they're my cousins and my nephew my niece um you know they were those were my kids back in the day when they were young and they right now they're they're adults now, so that's that. They're who I'm talking about when I say the kids um, when they were kids. Okay, so yeah, that's my kitchen, and uh, like I said, I'm gonna do more. And I, you guys know I always say I'm gonna do more, and I always make more than one video for you. Um, this is something I did on the table, but I'm not again not done with that either. But I think it's really cute. I did the kind of lavender looking grass. It's pink, but it has a purple hue to it. This is what I put my jelly beans and candies in. These right here are just kind of um, flatware holders. And these are the napkins that have lasted the test of time. They have been around a long time. And I just keep them in a plastic bag and there's still tons of them. And I just can't use enough of them. I bought them years ago and I think it had to be probably 500 in a bag because I have used these things for years and they are still, they're still plentiful. They're still plentiful. There are a lot left. So every year I use them and I'll just use them till they're gone because there's nothing wrong with them. They've been in plastic all this time. And yeah, so I'm gonna use those. They're really cute. And a little bunny on there with a carrot. And so yeah. We are definitely getting ready for Easter. And like I said, I need much more stuff. I need much more stuff. I need much more um, things to set around. You know what I mean? Like, and I just haven't seen a whole lot this, uh, I haven't seen a whole lot in the stores. Um, and I know that uh, there's a lot going on. The reason why we don't have um, all the things that we are used to having in the stores uh, they just are not stocked like they used to be uh, and ever since the pandemic you know that's been an issue so um, yeah we're we they're just not a lot to choose from and so I need to get online and just kind of see if I can see what I'm looking for and if not I have to go to some of the bigger stores like um, CJ Maxx uh, Marshall's maybe uh, at home is what we have here in, in Oklahoma uh, I think we have a Home Goods in Edmond, so I'm gonna try and see if I can find some a place that I know would have what I'm looking for, and just kind of eliminate going all around town. Just kind of go to the places I know that will have it. So let me show you my other my entryway table. You guys, I always show you my entry entryway table because I always decorate it for every holiday, and I think it's really cute this time. So let's show you. 
here it is. This is the Happy Easter sign. I had it last year, if you remember. The Happy Easter sign. I got some faux. Um, I'm not sure what these are. Peonies, maybe. Um, but they're they're cute and pink. I got those last year. Also, here's my Ray Dunn Easter bunny that I got last year. I got a dragon fruit kiwi um, candle that smells awesome. I got this from TJ Maxx. And there's another one of those vases that I have and I, I love so much. You know, we have a sign here. It says we believe in the Easter bunny. And we do. We believe in the Easter Bunny. We believe also in the true meaning of Easter. Definitely. It's instilled in us. So here's the other Ray Dunn piece, and it's um, hot to it, it says. And it's so cute. Just a bunny inside of the egg. So cute. And then we have this white three-wick candle that says Fireside. I think I got it from TJ Maxx as well. And yeah, so that's, that's all I've done so far. I put some pink... Um, candles in, in my candle holders here and it looks really cute so yeah you guys that's that's what I've done so far for Easter not a whole whole lot but it's really cute okay guys let me also show you the Easter candy I got um, I only got a few things that, that I saw um, I got them from where was I Dollar General that's where I got them from um, let me show you got the Lindor's Lent Lindor's Neapolitan, which I've never had this kind before. It, is, it has the Neapolitan, like Neapolitan ice cream. But it's Neapolitan white chocolate truffles. And it's got white chocolate on them. And I, I, I got them because they were in pink wrappers. You know me, trying to match for Easter. So that's why I got those. I got two packs. They're, it's a kind of a small bag, so I just got two of them. I um, also got the classic jelly beans or bird eggs, whatever you want to call them. And I got some of the Whopper Robin eggs. I got two of the jelly beans uh, and one of the Whopper Robin eggs. I love those. Those were the ones that when we were kids, we would lick them and then rub them on our lips like lip gloss and they would they would turn whatever color the, the candy was is what color your lips would be. So we used to love to do that. But anyway, these are the candies I picked up. Um, I still will probably pick up a few more. I want some Peeps. Gotta have peeps um, for Easter, so. And yeah, so I can't put them out yet. Uh, if I put them out right now, they'll be gone by Easter. They'll be gone before Easter for sure. So I'm not gonna put them out, I'm just gonna put them away and I'll bring them out uh, closer to Easter. And I'll just pick up some of the other candies that I need. But yeah, those, those are the candies I got so far. Okay guys, that's all for today. You guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please go down right here hit that subscribe button also hit your notification bell so you're notified every time I post a video and if you like this video give me a big thumbs up and I will see you in the next video bye